I don't think these fish even know I'm here. But maybe this will get their attention, huh? You know, I'll tell you what got my attention. It was some great racing on the half-mile oval at Queen City Speedway near Cincinnati, Ohio. The boys from the American Speed Association put on quite a show in their fiberglass-bodied stock cars. As a matter of fact, we had a camera in the car of Mark Martin, number two, running second behind Butch Miller, number 52. Let's pick up the action as the green flag is about to come out after a caution. We have got a restart, Brock Gates. We sure do, Steve Evans, as Butch Miller leads them off turn four. Right behind him, Mark Martin, in that beautiful red and white Thunderbird. And behind him, three-time ASA champion Mike Eddy in the green 88 Camaro. Mike Eddy looks anxious to make a move. Right on, in fact, here he comes. Mike Eddy on the outside, and he has just slicked his way right by Mark Martin. And now it is Treckle trying to get by Martin on the high side. And he is going to make it work into the frame of the in-car camera in just a moment. There he is. Dick Treckle is now running third. Our pole sitter has moved back to fourth. He is not a happy man. Well, the Chevy fans are cheering right now. They got three of their Camaros. One, two, three. Yes, we've got a pair of Thunderbirds back and forth and fifth. But this could be, as we said earlier, just a feeling out stage in this race as these five top pros just sort of work each other out and work the racetrack out. It is interesting, though, to notice that all the passing's been done on a high side Steve look at this Mike Eddy moves from back in this spot now to take over the lead and here goes trickle challenging uh, Butch Miller on the outside as well now trickle putting the same move on Miller that he did on Martin can he make this one work you bet he can so just a bear of a man three-time ASA champion in the green car Mike Eddy out in front but now our camera car Mark Martin is starting to make his own move on Butch Miller well, it seems like the high side is the fast way around this racetrack. You get down too low, and you're going to get past. As we watch Martin and Miller riding side by side through the turn three and four, but Mike Eddy right now has got himself about as big a lead as anybody has had in this race, and that's only about three car lengths. Right behind him, though, Dick Trickle, and then we've got Mark Martin, who has now moved back into third ahead of Butch Miller. Well, Miller right now is just sandwiched between two Thunderbirds. He's got Mark Martin in front of him and Bob Seneca behind him. Good, good racing here. We've seen lead changes. We've seen Eddie, Eddie come all the way from back in fifth. We've seen uh, Butch Miller go from first back to fourth. And we've seen the Pac-Man, Seneca, just sit back there and let 